building was opened as a psychiatric hospital in 1989 and operated um, until 1995 when it was sold and turned into a rehabilitation center. It changed hands two or three more times until Aurora Behavioral Health out of Southern California opened it in July of 2013. We're uh, an inpatient psychiatric facility where people uh, arrive in crises and remain with us on a 24-hour basis, usually for five to ten days until they're able to step down to a lower level of care. We also have what's called a partial hospitalization program, which operates five days a week, Monday through Friday, about six hours a day, and an intensive outpatient program, which operates three days a week for three hours a day. We uh, serve both adults and adolescents on a 24-hour basis, and our partial hospitalization program and intensive outpatient program is for adults. We become uh, a part of what's called the Jason Foundation, which is a suicide prevention program for adolescents. We take that out to the schools, let the school counselors and parents know about the program and um, try to be helpful and supportive to any family who's experiencing uh, trouble with their teenager and their teenager talking about suicide or making a suicide gesture. Sonoma County has been devoid of an inpatient program for several years now. And parents and families and patients have had to go out of the area to get inpatient mental health treatment. And that's difficult because they really need to be in therapy in their area and they need to have access to their families to do family therapy and going uh, out of the county has been a very difficult time for them. We want to be available to those in need.